Hello, Pelocity Posse. Welcome back to Pelocity. Welcome back to the Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we beat Leader Winona. Unfortunately, losing a team member in the process, but we beat Leader Winona. And now we're going to take Route 120 down to Mount Pyre and on our way to Lily Cove City. Now, before we continue, I do want to update you guys on the schedule and some changes that are going to be made here in the future. Now, as you know, we just bulk recorded a bunch of the previous episodes because I was working overtime and uh, it was kind of hard for me to even get the uploads scheduled every day. As you know, there was a day that was missed and th there's going to be some days missed in the future as well. So, instead of five days a week, we're going back to three days a week. Monday, Wednesday, Friday on the upload schedule. You're watching this on Friday, April 16th. Because on Wednesday, a video went up, but on Tuesday it was not a video. This is Tuesday, the day I'm recording this. I did not upload a video. Neither did I do Thursday. So this week is the first week of the Monday, Wednesday, Friday upload schedule again. Reason being is because, like I said, I got burnt out from working all those hours at work, coming home and working on the channel, and I didn't have a lot of time to spend doing anything else. I really wanted some more free time where I wasn't sat at a computer like I am at work and then I come home and I'm sat at a computer again. I just wanted to have some time to relax to myself, spend time with my family, and just enjoy more of my life right now and not be so work-ridden, so work-heavy. So, three episodes a week, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, is going to be the schedule from here on out, and it's probably going to be the uh, schedule for the future as well on all the, uh, all the content we produce on this channel. I hope you guys understand, but like I said, it's just really hard to have the drive, and obviously I would rather, and I think you would probably rather have this too, I would rather have quality over quantity. And I felt like when I was rushing to get all those videos bulk recorded and edited, the quality kind of suffered because the quantity was there. I want to get better quality, and if that means less content, then that's what we got to do, but that's what I'd rather have. So, I hope you guys understand. Um, that's just where I'm at. Tigers baseball's on again, too. I was missing some games. I just want to be able to relax and watch some baseball and spend time with my wife and do things that, you know, I honestly, during that six day, whatever, working six days a week that week and then having to come home and do this, and then I didn't get a chance to do a lot of that. So, I want to get back to that. Got to balance work a little bit better, balance the YouTube stuff a little bit better, and that's so that's where I'm at. I hope you guys understand. Thank you, and I appreciate your support all the way, and I, I, I appreciate your support all the way to the future as well. So thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, team recap now. And we've gotten that out of the way and out of the bag. We got Jawbreaker the Golem, level 34. You remember her? She's naughty. She's got a big shell armor on her. So she's got all the amulet coins. She gets paid more money. Because, you know, equal pay for equal gender, equal everything. Gotta be equal. We gotta get this thing situated. So let's get her some more money. Alright. Next, we've got Ivory the Wall Raid, Scope Lens, Gentle Nature Insomnia. He ain't sleeping. He's a very gentle boy, but he's not sleeping at all. Because he's got those glasses, the scope lenses on. So that's why. That's why he can't sleep. You gotta take those glasses off. Uh, Pineapple, newest edition. Replacing. Replacing Blossom. Never evolved. Unfortunately, never evolved. But we've got our Pineapple Duck on the team. Pineapple, the Ludicolo. Experience share for now. Volt Absorb, Tim and Nature. Looking good. Looking good. Silver the Lugia. Shed Skip. Relax Nature. Bright Powder Holding. Aeroblast. Psybeam. Fire Punch. Surf. Oh, man. He's a rockin' and rollin'. Crimson the Scizor. Level 34. Slash Wing Attack Pursuit. The Jilly Holding. The Scope Lens with Hustle. And Impish Nature. And lastly, Amaterasu. The Nine Tails. Naive Nature with Synchronize. Holding the Charcoal with Ember. Frenzy Plant. Confused Rain. Fire Blast. And that is how we have it set. Now, I thought there was a po person in this team. In this. No, match call. I could have sworn there was somebody here that taught you a move. Nope. Alright. 
I thought there was somebody that was like a move tutor in Fortree City, but I could be wrong. I don't know if I explored this house the last time. Nope. And nope. Okay, never mind. So, sorry for that. Let's, uh, I think we took down, it's been a while since I recorded, obviously, because I did all the bulk recording. Like I said, like I said it's been a long time. I already got this encounter. Um, I've already gotten the encounters all the way down, I believe. We already took on all these trainers, so really, we just went back to heal, and now we can just continue our adventure further. Did I take you on? Oh my gosh, Lombre. Yes, I took you on. I took everybody on over this area. The only people I have yet to take on are the uh, trainers on the uh, this little hill over here, past that grass on the left. So let's go up here. I did not take this person on yet in this rock covering. Um, let's get a Matarasu some action. And let's take this person on here. I already bailed you all. Okay. I guess I already bailed you. Oh, Stantler. Great. Alright. Definitely did not bail you yet. Okay. At first I didn't hear the music scrolling for his, uh... For his trainer but eventually I heard it I don't know why it took so long maybe I need to turn my music up a little bit there we go all right Amaterasu show this Abra what for give this thing a good smacking so guys I hope you're doing great it's been a long like I just said it's been a long time since I recorded last uh, I kind of just gave you the overview, really, of how I've been doing work and editing, and it's just... I was so burnt out in the middle of last week. I had... I came home, and I just was like, Babe, I'm sorry. I I don't know why I said I'm sorry to my wife for not doing YouTube, but I was like, I just cannot get... I didn't even have the motivation to do this right now. And, uh... I was just on the couch. I, I have been sleeping so much on the couch lately after work it's insane and I think it's just because I feel over overburdened with YouTube and with regular work stuff that at this point I just I bet I come home and I don't have time to relax I just I come home and I pass out on the couch after dinner and then by the time I wake up the baseball game's on and I, I don't want to edit because again it's on and I'm like oh I've already relaxed and it's like it's crazy so, that's kind of where I've made this decision lately, is just to kind of take a break from the rigorous upload schedule and just to go back to something more more regular. You know, you, you watch all these other content creators and all their schedules are Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Even if they're working with three people, there's Monday, Wednesday, Monday, Wednesday Friday. Um, you know, it's a better balance, I think. You need to find that balance, and I think overloading on YouTube just was not getting the quantity quality of the content that I wanted to get out to you guys and we just need to get back to that I think we just need to get back to that we need to make sure that whatever we it's got flash fire of course it's got flash fire we just need to get back to that and I hope you guys notice the difference I really do I really hope you notice the difference in the quality of the content that's being brought to you on this Pulosity channel that little bear could just go die but you know, I, I, I'm here for you, and I'm here for, uh, you know, everybody that is actually in my life, I'm here for. I want to help everybody out. All right, so this is where Reggie Steel normally is. No other trainers. So, okay, we came this way for nothing. Okay. All right. All right. So, I guess all we have to do now... Um, is head this way now did I get route 121 as an encounter I feel like I snuck around these trainers and got the encounter and then flew back I'm gonna skip it for now I'm gonna skip this encounter for now but what I will do is when I get to the next Pokemon Center or the next PC or whatever I will check to see because I do believe we caught something in this grass. 
It's been a while. The video has not been uploaded yet. So, I, again, I don't know because I haven't even edited the video yet as you're watching this. That video where I caught this Pokemon, if I did, is going up on... Um, it would have gone up on Wednesday. So, yeah. Frenzy plant. See you later, Barboach. So, yeah, I, I don't know what I caught. I really don't. Because... Or am I or am I wrong? Hang on a second. I'm actually I might be wrong here in assuming multiple things. I might be wrong in assuming multiple things. If we go to uh, episode thirty, which was the most recent upload, episode thirty-one. Okay, there's episode thirty-one, episode thirty-two. Okay, so that was last episode. Okay. I was just making sure that the upload that, you know, we did the gym and this route all in the same episode. I wanted to make sure that, that was the case. Because to be honest, I wasn't sure. Okay, let's get back to the game now. All right. Yeah, I wanted to make sure that, that was all in the same, all in the same recording. Because it, then I, all of a sudden I just started having this like weird panic attack that I... I actually didn't do the t uh, all the same episode that they were two separate recordings, but no, I do believe I sped down here. I took these trainers on and speed up, and then I went back to the gym and took the gym on. I remember now. Yes. Again, it's been such a long time. I just wanted to kind of make sure in my brain that that's what happened. So, uh, Needle Queen. Okay. Uh, Ivory, come on. Come on, dude. Use those tusks and move this thing out of the way like a a bulldozer, you know? Like a bulldozer. Doze the bull. Oh, yeah. Look at that. That is what I call not a big wave. It's a big wave is what that is, actually. It's what I call not a big wave. It's like what's what I call not this. I can't English today. Cannot English today. Oh, okay. Let's try this again. I cannot believe it's not butter. I cannot believe it's not a big wave because it actually is a big wave because I'm saying that I can't believe it's not butter is actually butter. Okay. That's what I meant to say. Thank you for letting me redo my words and figure out what I want to actually say. Now let's get out of here. Because this is not a pretty picture. I don't like having a half water type sitting there across from my Oh, it's got it's got true on. Okay. Well that makes this easy. That makes this a lot easier, actually. That makes this a thousand times easier than what it would have been. I I I'm telling you. Watch that. Look at that clap. Look at that. Look at that. Now, fingers, the nails just like Alright. Gain that experience. Yeah, little corfish. Little corfish. Okay. This should one shot. Oh yeah. No problems. Nothing coming up. I think what we're gonna do in this episode is a safari zone. That's what we're gonna do. We're not going to Mount Pyre yet. We're doing the safari zone. We're going on a safari. Okay, we move out to Mount Pyre. All right. Well, there's that. A hard stone. Gosh, I, I would have hate to find a soft stone. That's, that's that would have sucked. That would have been not good. Oh, evergreen. Oh, evergreen. I don't know if this is my encounter. I can't remember if I... Okay. I'll be right back, guys. I gotta check the previous video to make sure that I didn't get this encounter. I'll be right back. Alright, so we in fact already did get this encounter. It was the... Mm, all while. Mm, you, you know, you've already seen this episode. I haven't posted it yet, so I kind of had a weird freeze. But yes, you have already seen it. I have already gotten this encounter, so let's skip that. Um double battle here. 
I'm gonna heal up a Matarasu. If I have any uh, more healing items. I have plenty of soda pops, so that'll work. And let's take this double battle on on our way to the Safari Zone. Uh, this battle always gave me some kind of problems because they also, this trainer also normally has a um, slacking. Oh, look at that. The teacher and the student each have a Graveler Geodude combo. That's, that's just amazing. That's just amazing. Uh, Psybeam, let's knock this, let's just take these things out, please. Why is the Geodude stronger than the Graveler? That's my question. That's my question for you, you two. You know, why are we teaching your student not to evolve their Pokemon, you know? Like, what's going on here, you know? Like, why are we doing these things? This is not good teaching. Not good practices, you know. Okay. So, we get one encounter for the Safari Zone. I think, in, in total. I don't think every area of the Safari Zone we get another encounter. I think it's just the one encounter for the whole thing. So, let's go in. Oh. Lily Cove! All right, well, guess we gotta go to Lilico first to get the stupid Pokeblock case. So we'll skip these trainers for now. And go get the stupid Pokeblock case. From the contest hall. Which is right here, and now, of course, now we gotta find out who the hell to talk to to get the stupid Pokeblock case. Uh, just anybody? Yes, there we go. Thank you. Okay. Give me that so I can turn right around and go back to where I wanted to be to begin with. I guess we could take these trainers on. Actually, I want to use these trainers as some training for any new encounters we get. So. I am going to actually try to dodge these trainers if at all possible. I want to skip those items for now too because of the same reason. So okay, now we're back. Let's grab our Safari Zone encounter. I have 30 balls. And you do get a limit. so. Unfortunately, I think you each each area. I don't think you have a map, do you? Or do you get like So every area has a, the the drop down menu shows up every time there's a new area. So Okay. But again, I don't know what Pokémon are in what area. So it's going to kind of be like whatever. Just grab what you can, I suppose. And hope that what you get isn't crap. So let's just grab the encounter in this grass here and grab our Safari Zone encounter. Alright. Alright. Uh, I just gotta hope I can catch this thing. But I will take this. Um, Safari Zone mechanics are always crap. Because the Pokemon can just run whatever it wants and throw a ball. Just throw the ball. There it goes. Overthink it. Do not overthink it. Don't overthink it. Grab that old shrimp. The old shrimp. It was resurrected from a fossil using the power of science. It swims by undulating its eight wings at the sides. It's an old shrimp. Pokemon. Wow. Okay. Okay. We have a uh, an Anorith that is going to evolve into our Maldo. Our Maldo is a big shrimp. Hmm. 
All right, not many of you know might know the reference I'm making, but Armaldo is what is this thing evolves into. And if you don't know, back in 2000, I believe it was 2007, the Tigers played the Indians and at Comerica Park, and Armando Galarraga came one out away from a perfect game, and that out was because an umpire did not call the runner out at first base. He made a mistake, called him safe. It was this whole thing, the imperfect game, Armando Galarraga. So if this thing is going to evolve into Armaldo, I think we should just name it Galarraga because then it'll be Ar Armaldo Galarraga. So that's the name we're going with, Armaldo Galarraga. Galarraga will head to the PC and we will go dig him up and go check him out. What else was in here? Espeons, Lairons. Oh man, could have had such power. Uh, would you like to exit the safari zone? Yes. Take my balls back and let me back in. So we're only gonna get the good one encounter in the safari zone. I don't want to abuse the encounters. So let's uh, grab our Maldo or Anorith at this point and let's just drop him in the box one and take a look at him and see what he's rocking. Lax nature and forecast. How is that gonna work? Changes with the weather. How is it gonna form change? Interesting. That's interesting. We will leave it there for now. But that's very interesting. How that's gonna work. Because cast form has the forms. Very strange. Mount Pyre Pier. Okay. Well, let's hop on Lugia here. And get ourselves another encounter. Because this is the episode of the encounters. Route 122. On the water. Did I already catch you? No, I didn't. And I was in the last recording. Gosh darn it. Oh, man. Yeah, I don't have a jinx either. Nope. And this thing just doesn't want to be caught. Um... Just catch, please. It doesn't want to be caught. Well, we might not have a choice here, folks. There we go. Okay. Well. We named her this before. We'll name her this again and just dump her in the PC just so we don't have to deal with her. And I'm never going to add this thing to the team. I don't care for it all that much. Get to the PC. And stay in there in box one. Thank you. All right. What else was in here? Oh, it's got Sandstream. Okay, or at least that one of its abilities is Sandstream. I don't know if that first one did because it wasn't taking sand damage. Oh! That's, that's great. <sighs> well... Run away, heal up. That'll be the next thing I gotta do. Crimson, get healed. Now, we could go into Mount Pyre now, but we don't have a lot of time left, so I'm gonna actually just head down to Route 123 and get our encounter Route 123. Because this route actually takes you all the way back uh, to the beginning. We didn't get that encounter. So let's grab Route 123. That is going to be Dupalupus. Dupalupus. For sure. That's... That's species. That is species claws. So... Wow. Okay. Try again. Alright. Well, this is going to be interesting. 
This is going to be very interesting. Anything. Anything! That's not dupes. There we go. Asparagus. All right. Give me something else. Uh, how do I mean to weaken you? Pursuit should not do a lot. And I fell asleep. Gotta be kidding me. All right. Now we throw the balls. Put to sleep again. Just catch the dang thing. All right. Well, I'm gonna switch out. Do I have any um anything to do to this thing? I could confuse it, but I don't know if that'll make me easier to catch. Nope. I don't have any way to uh, any way to status this thing. I just have to hope it catches. There we go! Ivy Soar on the squad. I don't know if he's gonna get the squad yet, but it's definitely tempting. Asparagus, we had you in platinum. I did it again. God, I, I hate I hate this thing. We had you in platinum. We got you again. We're rebuilding the team. We're rebuilding the Platinum Squad. Alright. Get to someone's PC. Box 1. Now we'll go into Mount Pyre. And we'll get another encounter. The episode of all the encounters. It's happening now. And it's happening right here live on Paulosity. We have one more encounter before the end of this episode. And here it is, inside Mount Pyre. It's a plusle. Mm, not what I wanted. Not what I wanted. Um, I could probably just throw balls and catch it, right? Yeah, one ball. One ball, plusle, the cheering Pokemon. Hmm. Well, it's got a plus sign on it. It's got a little plus sign on it, so let's just call her Positivity. How about that? Positivity. Positivity. T. Oh, look at that. Perfectly fit. Positivity. Gotta get positive. Don't like that negativity. Gotta make it positive. Okay. So, we are going to call it quits here. I'm going to save the game off screen. I'm going to go and check out our team. I'm going to go see what we can do. Get some maybe some team members added or not. And maybe we'll just rock out what we have right now. I don't know. Hard to judge. But we will go into Mount Pyre. We will make it to the top of Mount Pyre and take on Team Aqua and find them next time. Thanks guys so much for watching. Thanks so much for, for supporting. And I, I know the upload schedule might not be the best for some of you. I know you guys like the content and all. But again, please uh, understand that it's harsh on my schedule right now and what I'm doing, so I've got to take a step back. But I appreciate you all all the time, no matter what. Thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you right here next time on Paulosity.